In this problem, we're being asked to find the limit as x approaches 2 of x cubed minus 8 over x minus 2. So the problem is if we plug in 2 right away, we end up with 8 over 8, 8 minus 8 rather, over 2 minus 2, which is 0 over 0. And that's undefined. So the trick is to recall a formula from algebra. If you have a cubed minus b cubed, and the way I memorize this formula is it's a, and then you keep the sign, so minus b, and then you have a squared, and then you switch the sign, so we have a minus, so we put a plus, and then it's ab, and it's always plus here no matter what, so b squared. So in this case, we can rewrite our limit as follows. This is the limit as x approaches 2. Uh, well, let's see, x cubed minus 8. So in this case, it's x cubed minus 2 cubed. So a is x and b is 2. So it's going to be x minus 2 and then parentheses and then x squared plus and then ab. So in this case, it's simply 2x. Boom, there it is. And then plus b squared, which is 4. Beautiful stuff. All divided by x minus 2. And so you see now that these guys cancel. And so we end up with the limit as x approaches 2 of the quantity x squared plus 2x plus 4. And so this is equal to 2 squared plus 2 times 2 plus 4. Just plugging in the 2. Remember, when you're taking limits, if you can plug in the number and it makes sense, go for it. And this is 4 plus 4 plus 4, which is 12. And that is the limit as x approaches 2 of the quantity x cubed minus 8 all divided by x minus 2. Super easy. Problems like this aren't about being smart or being witty. It's all about recognizing that you have the difference of cubes and just knowing this formula. If you know this formula, you can do this problem every single time. So I hope that helps.